Ahoy there! You're finally here! I've been waiting for a long time. Even my deck is getting burrs. But this boat! Does this boat even have a deck? This is a dinghy at most! Ha ha ha! Who would have thought that I, the notorious pirate ship commanded by Akko Domeki, would one day end up like this? So, you're a big pirate ship? Uh, but who's Akko Domeki? What? You don't even know who Akko Domeki is? Akko Domeki Simon? Defender of Serai! The name of the most feared pirate ever to sail the seas! Oh. <sighs> Who would have thought? Nope, the name doesn't ring a bell. <laughs> Alright, Mitaboru, you told us to come here, so tell us, what is this all about? It feels so weird being called that all of a sudden. Uh, you see, as I said, I'm here because I drifted here. So I'm thinking my original body must be nearby. It feels strange using the word body. <laughs> but I do need to find it as soon as possible. I've lost track of how long I've been sleeping here, but I'm certain my companions will still be waiting for me. I need to find my body, get ship shape, and return to them as soon as possible. Right! <laughs> Aye, but I can't make it there on my own. After all, a talking ship is just a ship. It still needs someone at the wheel. Let's make a deal. You help me find my body, and I will help you find treasure in return. Treasure? I'm a pirate ship after all. Call it a pirate ship's intuition, or some kind of sixth sense. Either way, the moment I woke up, I could sense that this area is filled with valuable treasures. You have my word. A pirate ship always finds its treasure, Arr. Or may I be blighted with barnacles. What say ye, me hearties? Do we have an accord? Let's help me to borrow. If he finds his body and we get treasure in return, everybody wins! <laughs> so? Will you help me or not? Great! Well, there's a place I wanted to go to as soon as I woke up. Based on my pirate ship's intuition, there be some big treasure hidden there. Arr, let's head there and search for it. Time to set sail! What are my orders?
Okay, let's go check it out. But a shipwreck. Oh, Mitaburu had better not be lying to us. Guess it's time to go back and ask our friend a couple of questions. How did it go? Did you find anything valuable? <laughs> Mitaburu! There's nothing on this island except for a shipwreck! What kind of intuition is that? What? No! Impossible! Ah! I know. It must be because I've been sleeping for too long, and my intuition is not as sharp as it once was. Uh... As the saying goes, Nobody's perfect, and certainly no boat's perfect either, right? Cut me a little slack, huh? The next place will be the one. I'm sure the next place will be full of treasure. It better be. No more playing tricks on us this time. You have my word. But, um... The next place is a little far away. And I'm not sure of the precise location. All I know is that it's somewhere northwest of here. But there are so many islands in the northwest. Oh, you gotta give us a little more than that. Wait a minute. If you mean one of the larger islands, there are only two of them in the northwest. Musical flowers, hmm? Indeed. Among the sounds I'm sensing, I hear music drifting across the sea. But not just the sound of music, no. There's the non-stop cawing of ravens, too. To be precise, the cawing is coming from the east, and the music is coming from the southwest. So, you're hearing two sounds? Ugh, where could this darn treasure be? But where can you hear the sounds from both islands at the same time? Oh, you're right! Yep, that's exactly what Paimon was thinking, too. Ah, then let's go over and take a look. Ha 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 ha! You know, I must say, it seems you two are quite close. You bet! We've been on loads of adventures together, and found lots of treasure before. Arr, if only I'd been able to speak back when we were sailing on the sea, then maybe I would have been able to communicate with my companions just like you two. You seem to have so much fun together. I'm a little jealous. <laughs> All right. Time to find the center location of these two big islands.
Here we are! This is right in between both islands. There better be some treasure this time! Anyway, was there no treasure this whole time? Um, oh, what does that mean? Oh, like they're ship friends. Hey, why don't we take a picture of the boat and show it to me, Taboru? Then he can confirm whether it's his body or not. <laughs> Pictures. Come on, let's go back and show them to me tomorrow. Me tomorrow. There you are. How did it go? Did you find something? Let me guess. You found a huge, oh, a huge load of nothing. Oh, I dropped the cannonball again, didn't I? Same as last time. Just another shipwreck. Maybe they're parts of your body. We took pictures of them. Take a look. Is this a painting? I didn't know you two could paint so well. Just look at the detail. Down to the smallest blade of grass. It's just like the real thing. We didn't paint this. We took it using a camera. So, it was drawn by a machine, through some high-speed mechanism. So even the mighty pirate ship has never seen a camera before. What are you trying to say? It's not like I haven't seen similar things before. It's just like the hell paintings in all of those legends. But anyway, what's that thing in the middle of this... picture? That's the shipwreck we found. Take a look. Could it be your body? 
Ha! Impossible! Where did this sorry ship come from? It's a total wreck! You may not know this, but I'm considered as the mightiest pirate ship of the Akodomiki fleet. My hull is made of the best wood found on Seirai Island. The edges of my frame boards were refined with folding saws so that the pieces fit together perfectly. Then they were joined together and reinforced with large rivets, making me indestructible. There's no way I could end up like this. But your intuition led us to shipwrecks twice in a row. It's probably because of the special bond between all boats that draws us to one another. Before they run aground, these ships may well have been self-aware too. The remnants of their spirit is most likely what I sensed. Anyway, this can't be my body. My body's probably docked at a hidden port somewhere in these waters. You'll see. My side panels are painted with the finest lacquer. Arr, what a majestic sight I used to be. Once we find it, you'll realize how different I am from this shipwreck in your picture. That sounds great! We should go for a cruise together sometime.